no one was born or learned in school how to be a lifeguard. You come and take that training. But if you're willing to learn, we can teach it. With a weekend of warmer temperatures, there's finally a moment to look forward and see how close we are to spring and summer. However, as many dream of days at the beach and sitting in the sun, some are worrying what summer will look like when it comes to keeping people safe. News 5's Clay Lepard takes a look at what's being done to address an ongoing lifeguard shortage. Inside the Jaga Family YMCA, classes are underway, teaching the next generation of lifeguards. Among them, 17-year-old Rylan Anderson. Honestly, it's just a good job to have in the summer. And retiree Laurel Peterson. I would never go anywhere with my two boys without a lifeguard until they were teenagers. It's a critical class, experts say, as the number of new lifeguard certifications continues to decline throughout Northeast Ohio. The pandemic has definitely played a factor in having that depth on our roster. Um, there's some of us that are having to guard way more frequently than we'd like to. The impact behind fewer of these lifeguard certifications, which typically last for about two years, is already being seen. Last summer, Lake Metro Parks went as far as announcing that Fairport Harbor Lakefront Park would be without lifeguards on Tuesdays and Wednesdays because of a lack of staffing. To make it accessible, uh, we are removing barriers. Philip Hearn serves as aquatic director at the Hillcrest Family YMCA and says last year there were moments where they had limited hours because of a lack of staffing. And for parents, those at the YMCA of Greater Cleveland say the wait list for swim lessons continues to grow with limited lifeguards available to teach. Hearn says they're now going as far as covering the cost for these certifications, which can cost around several hundred dollars to obtain to bring in the next generation of lifeguards. A lot of rec centers, a lot of places make you pay for your certification to even come and work for them. Whereas we are um, waiving or reimbursing that lifeguard class fee if you come and work for us. Anyone interested in learning how to become a lifeguard can learn more by clicking on this story on the News 5 app and on news5cleveland.com. In Cleveland, Clay Lepard, News 5.